My name is Aaron Castellan. I am one of the writers on Carcero. Well, the way I came into this was I knew Bill Holmes uh, through his son. His son and I, his son went to Ithaca College and uh, for a, a couple of years before transferring back here and I was his roommate for a year and when I moved out to Los Angeles he was the only person I knew so I hit him up and I just got to know him and his family and Bill included and they're all generous people and when this opportunity came up Bill was like oh well you're you're a writer right and I was like well yeah I, <laughs> so I mean basically it was just like the, the 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 opportunity of like knowing Bill and having done a lot of writing that like you know he just gave me the opportunity and I was excited to jump at it I was pretty new to this kind of this genre I mean obviously I'm a fan of like these kind of like fantasy like novels and, and movies and stuff but in terms of writing it I'd never written anything in this genre before because I'd mostly just been writing uh, bad pilot after bad pilot through most of my 20s and what that kind of teaches you is a little bit of, but like when you write pilots you kind of have to do everything condensed like everything has to happen very quickly in a short and condensed amount of time and so going from that writing those to this was kind of nice because here you you know you have certain things that have to happen in each episode but you get you, we were given a lot of freedom to make those things happen in however way we thought most interesting and so that's a credit to like you know Shane kind of letting us do do operate however we felt like operating I mean f for me it's I mean I just love like the things that thing that's drawn to me to writing or telling stories in any capacity is just like care of the people like I'm endlessly curious about people and w how they do the things they do, why they do the things they do and things like that. The more you make the people in this story, even though they're in a world that's not like ours, the more you make them re instantly recognizable and have all of the traits and quirks and characteristics of people that you interact with every day, the more you hear it instantly and you're like, yep, I know that person, I know that kind of person, I know that kind of person. And that's one of the most satisfying things to me when I'm watching something. Digging into the characters and kind of going on this journey with them and being able to see them change and be challenged and um, be forced to confront a lot of their insecurities and uh, just things about themselves that they don't like, things about the world that they don't like and getting to see that play out and like have a hand in helping write it was 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 pretty cool. That's like that's why you want to write stuff and tell stories. I don't know just I hope I hope you enjoy it like I hope it's I hope it's you get something that makes you laugh, makes you you know sad, makes you angry Make sure to download the next one. For fuck's sake, just download the next one. <laughs>